Hey guys, we are back. We're here with our BoxyCharm base box. Um, I haven't done one of these videos in a while. I just figured I'd unbox this for you because I actually got a, bo a really good box for once. So here we are with our theme. This be my Glamantine. And on the back we have our items with our pr product name, uh, description, and pricing. So jumping right into the box, I have here this Bali Balm Pineapple Lip Scrub. Let's see what this says. It's a sugar scrub packed with juicy pineapple fragrance and foliating sugar. King crystals to gently buff and polish away the dead skins. And this retails for $23. Oh my god, I just dropped it. I've had one of their lip balms before, and it's actually a decent lip balm. Oh. Mm, this does smell so good. It smells like real pineapple. Now, when I say real pineapple, there is pineapple smells that are like kind of artificial, but this smells like a real pineapple. There's that. Mm, that smells so good. I'm definitely going to try that for sure. Um, this is a teen, teeny detox mask, green tea blend, matcha, lemongrass, clay. Hmm. This is a clay, yeah, green tea detox mask. It's made with organic matcha green tea, lemongrass, bentonite clay. I think bentonite clay is actually good for acne prone skin, I believe. So I'm going to definitely give this a try. Formulated to rid pores of impurities while replenishing the skin with necessary superfood nutrients. This retails for $29.99. I feel like I've seen this brand, maybe this specific mask, like promoting, floating around Instagram. Oh, it's definitely clay for sure. Just a fresh herbaly scent. More fresh than anything. It looks like it's going to be... That looks like a fun mask. Like your whole face is going to be green. Put your little cucumbers on your eyes. <laughs> That'll work very nicely. Okay. Um, in here we have... The Hydra Studding Spray by Illamasqua. I heard that this has a lot of good makeup products. Like, I think their, uh, like, Pore Vanishing Primer is pretty popular because it's like a jelly consistency. Um, it's lightweight mist that locks in the makeup for a flawless, dewy finish, non-sticky formula. It's infused with pea peptides, rich in amino acids. It's a hydra setting spray. will leave the skin feeling refreshed and moisturized. $26. Might as well just... I don't think it smells like anything. Which is not a bad thing. Because when products have a certain smell or perfume smell, I'm not with it. But that, again... Retails for $26. It's a decent setting spray. Setting spray, setting spray. Um, next in here, we have the Wander Beauty Wondrous Escape Eyeshadow Palette. It features hyaluronic acid to help the skin retain moisture, rose hip seed oil to help smooth out dry skin I'm guessing for your eyelids because this is an eyeshadow palette <laughs> it's a mix of neutral and bold colors with shimmer satin matte finishes and they're crease proof for all day wear this retails for $42 so there's that Take out the film. I mean the packaging is really really nice there it's got a whole theme um Wonder Beauty tends to make it in a lot of boxy uh like uh, monthly boxes subscriptions so here is the eyeshadow palette it is pretty neutral with your pop of blue teal here and maybe this 
it's like a purplish pinkish color so that is maybe your pops of colors but it looks decent we'll swatch it might as well right because we're here and we use eyeshadow and let's do this that is the shade moonlit Ooh, i think i'm gonna like this one this is like a cool tone purple pink i i have a thing for cool tone shadows nowadays and that is enchanted let me try to clean my fingers here oh holy crap oh now this is flourish now you see that that's like a foiled shadow now when i say oh crap look at what it happened when i so it's definitely a foiled shadow it's one of those that you're gonna have to definitely uh blend that out because it will for sure crumble on the eye uh we have sun kissed it's like a peachy neutral santorini Ooh, that's very nice nude beach it's pretty much a nude matte kind of like my skin tone there it kind of blends in in my hand then we have daydream very nice gold oh this is like a gold gold this is like that yellow gold stargaze Sea glass and this is overnight okay my swatches are not the greatest but there they are really nice I mean those foiled shadows like flourish daydream stargaze and sea glass you definitely have to be careful with those because they will get very crumbly if you use too much so you'll definitely have to take your time with those shadows because they will get very messy very PC as you can see in the palette, just swatching them, you're gonna be able to tell. But it's a very nice palette. I did not think that they were gonna swatch that nice. But there they are. Try not to get it on my shirt, but for the sake of video, I wanted to show you that. Okay, so that, yep, that palette was $42. And last but not least, we have Ace Beauté. This is a Glow Essentials Highlighter palette now this is what i uh picked in my box um me and highlighter we just you know me and highlighter there is the palette oh, damn i just put my finger in it okay well might as well swatch that pink one there could definitely add that into my look because we're all pink here these are definitely uh nice yeah they're they definitely give off the color i don't know if you can see it on camera but it's definitely picking up some color in camera for sure so let's go back into that swatch that is the pink shade down here is radiant we got icy i mean this one's gonna be like my favorite it's that regular gold it's called glowing then we have poppin now poppin is like this one now this it comes off white in the pan but it has a pink shimmer there so this is like a full-on pink undertone and pigment and glow but this has a white base with pink glow there Then we have Gleaming, which is your rose gold, and Beaming, which is your darker bronzy gold. Very nice palette. I don't think it's like super blinding, but it's definitely glowy, and it definitely has color to it, so if you don't really like those color highlighters i don't mind them i definitely have to be in the mood to wear them but these three golds here are really actually pretty nice and you can definitely mix and match some of these 
tone down the colors if you want to, but they swash pretty nice and they are wearing. Actually, that is kind of blinding now that I'm they <laughs> look at that in the camera pretty well. But there is that. Now this is it's each shade is buildable and glides easy on the skin, giving you a seamless glowing look. This retails for $40. HPT is a brand that's kind of growing on me. I have a couple of their shadow eyeshadow palettes that are just really nice and nice to add the highlighters to my collection here. That's it. That's all we have for our BoxyCharm base box. This is our February box. Um, it was a nice box. You have all your glow items, your face sprays. So I did like this box. I'm looking forward to see what next month has because it is the Lux box. So I, I still do have Lux. I already canceled premium though. I just stuck with the base and I do still have Lux. Now, hopefully Lux, you know, surprises me next month. We'll do an unboxing on the channel. If not, we're going to skip that video. But because I don't want to open the items if I'm just not going to use them and i rather give it away. Anyways, long story short, here is our base box, and I did like all the items. I'm definitely going to get use out of these. Uh, thank you for watching. As always, like and subscribe. Yeah, thank you for watching. Until next time, guys. See ya. Bye.